It is struggling obviously with the 150 grams, but it's still handling it. It's not triggering the landing. All right, 190 grams. <laughs> All right, it's still hovering. <laughs> it's still hovering properly. 190 grams on DJI Flip. Have you seen a DJI Flip lifting the weights, lifting the payload? I hope not. Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how much weight this drone will be able to lift. I have made myself a payload system. <laughs> so this is a disposable cup. I have made a plan to connect it to my drone. So then I'll be able to put the objects here. On my channel, you always see this kind of crazy experiments on all the DJI drones. I have done this payload test on many uh, previous models. In this video, I'm going to attempt on this DJI Flip. I hope nobody has done it yet. I'm going to be the first one. So let's see how much weight this drone will be able to lift. I have few objects here. Uh, this, this is a battery charger, which weighs about 50 grams. Then these are my car keys with this keychain on weighing about 90 grams. I do have this screwdriver set, which is 150 grams. And then this motion controller for the DJI FPV drone, which is weighing about 190 grams. So it's going to be really challenging for this drone. Let's see how this drone will react. I'll start from obviously from the lowest one, the 50 grams one. Then I'll keep increasing and let's see how this drone will react. So the max weight which I have here is 190 grams. If this drone can could lift that one also, then I will even add something else and increase it. Let's see how this drone will react. It's going to be really amazing and challenging for this drone. So you can make this kind of stuff and use it on your drone also and you can put your chocolates here and deliver it to the kids <laughs> it's very it's very looking very actually it's not looking bad all right the drone is on let me hover it and then i will put some weight on it i'm going to start from the first one 50 gram weight let's see how this drone will react <laughs> all right Here is the drone, pretty stable, with no problems at all, hovering properly. And the motors, they are not having a very extreme stress. It's very light. There's no, there's no extreme stress on the motors right now. I don't see any stress here. It's pretty, it's looking pretty nice. Hovering properly. Let's fly this drone around a little bit. Let's see how this drone will react. When it's in the flight with this 50 grams, I'm gonna face the camera all the way down. So we will be able to see our payload. <laughs> all right. It's detecting uh, that cup uh, as a landing point. All right, it's shaking a lot shaking a lot in the wind. Here is something to learn. If I'm facing the camera all the way down to that object which is hanging on my drone and uh, that you see that black mark there, the landing point which is drone choosing by itself. So if it's coming on that cup then the drone will just trigger the automatic landing because of the vision sensors they will detect the, so the vision sensors they will act as uh, they are already on the landing position they are already approaching the ground or something is just covering the vision sensors so they will act as uh, they are uh, already on the ground and it will just trigger the landing so that's what was happening just now let me move it so if we cover the vision sensors then the drone is going to trigger the landing all right, let's remove this 50 grams and uh, I'm going to put this 90 grams now, the car keys, let's see how the stone is going to react now. All right, 90 grams, still hovering pretty nicely, no problems at all. I don't see any extreme stress on the motors as well. It's hovering pretty nicely with the 90 grams as well. Let's fly it also a little bit around and see how it will react when it will be flying with this 90 gram payload. All right. There it goes with the 90 grams with no problems at all. 
let me just face the camera down to see all right there is my payload it's flying properly with no problems all right so 90 grams also was not a problem for this drone it's flying pretty proper it's flying pretty nicely stable not having any issues you can see how nice and stable it is right now with no problems at all it is a little bit windy that's why the drone is shaking but otherwise it does not have any problems with that 90 gram at all all right let's increase the weight let's go to 150 grams and let's see how this drone will react now i'm going to put this screwdriver kit now let's remove that 90 gram and put this 150 grams it is feeling a bit relief it was having a bit of stress obviously not in too much but at least it had some stress if it was dji neo dji neo was crying on even 70 uh, 70 grams also but obviously this drone weighs about 250 grams so it's handling it pretty nicely all right 150 grams let's see how this drone will react now all right <laughs> now we see <laughs> that cup was shaking so it could not handle it properly let's do it again all right let me hold it and put it in properly <laughs> all right <laughs> now and now i can see this drone is struggling a bit <laughs> but it still it is still flying it is struggling obviously with the 150 grams but it's still handling it is not triggering the landing like the dji neo it will just trigger the landing or it will just start coming down this drone is still hovering properly with 150 grams also obviously the motors they do have some stress on them now but it's still trying and managing it there is dji flip flying with 150 grams all right <laughs> there it is struggling is doing the same stuff like the dji neo struggling a lot now <laughs> all right let me just relief it i just released it it was hovering then it just started to battle started to battle for its life <laughs> uh, i just i just let it go but the test is not over yet we still have this 190 grams as well i have to try with this weight as well let's see if this one will able to handle it and lift it obviously i will not fly it around with this 190 but let's see Let's see how the drone will react. All right, 190 grams. <laughs> All right, it's still hovering. <laughs> it's still hovering properly. 190 grams on DJI Flip. Struggling a lot, but is hovering. Let me fly it around and see. if this how this drone will react on this 190 grams if it will win i will try to increase weight more i'll even try to increase it more all right there it goes with 190 grams <laughs> flying with the dji motion controller in the cup and it's pretty stable there's nothing wrong still It was doing, uh, it was doing that um, funny landing on the 150 grams, but 190 grams is still flying with no issues at all. I guess I can even increase weight, increase it more. First of all guys I will never recommend you to try this kind of stuff with your drone this is really extremely dangerous for your drones IMU and obviously uh, ESC as well it can damage your ESC very very badly so never try this stuff with your drone it can damage your ESC it can damage your motors 
I just do this kind of stuff just to entertain you guys and test the products of the DJI. But I will never encourage you to do this kind of stuff with your drone. Just watch it, enjoy it. Don't try it. All right, 190 grams plus 90 grams, 280 grams. Uh, maybe this drone will be down to the ground same time. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> All right, I'll just put the 190 grams first and then I'll add 90 grams on top of it as well. Let's see how it will react. There it, 190 grams. All right, it's already, it's already not even lifting that 190 grams now. I guess maybe the battery is low. But the drone is just going straight down to the ground. <laughs> it's not lifting the 190 grams anymore. Yeah, I can see uh, the battery is low now. It's only one bar. So that is the reason the battery is not having enough power. But the 190 grams also was not bad. That was very great for this drone, which is weighing only 250 grams is lifting 190 grams easily but even if it is lifting 190 grams i will not recommend you to lift 190 grams maybe you can just try with the 100 grams but don't go more than 100 grams that will put a lot of stress on your motors and esc as well and it might damage one of them so i hope you like the video if you do like the video please subscribe my channel i'll see you in the next one ciao ciao